welcome back to our channel i hope you are doing extremely well today we have a special video in which we will see 30 most important frequently asked mcqs from all the units whether you are studying for exam or just want to brush up your knowledge this video is for you guys we have already uploaded some mcq videos you can go through that also videos for better score you can find the link of those videos in the description box now let's dive into the question without wasting any time so the first question is what is the primary purpose of registers in digital electronics this is very fundamental one option a data storage option b arithmetic operations option c logic operations and last option control flow so the correct option is data storage next question which of the following is characteristics of safe registers option a random access option b serial data transfer option c parallel data transfer and last option non volatile storage the correct option for this serial data transfer moving to next question combinational circuits are designed to implement options are sequential logic option b memory operations option c arithmetic operations and last option only logic operations the correct option is only logic operations next question is what differentiates sequential circuits from combinational circuits option are feedback loop option b memory elements option c clock signal last option input output interface correct option is memory element next question in computer organization what is the function of a bus options are data storage next option data transfer third option arithmetic operations and last option logic operations the correct option is data transfer moving to next question which micro operation is responsible for moving data from memory to process, processors register option a bus transfer option b memory transfer option c logic micro operation or last option shift micro operation correct option is memory transfer next question is register transfer language is used to options are program microprocessors option we define micro operations option c execute arithmetic operations and last option implement combinational circuits the correct option is define micro operations next question is what is the purpose of instruction code in the computer or organization option a control the instruction cycle option b define computer registers option c execute arithmetic operations and last option interface with peripheral devices correct option is control the instruction cycle next question is which organization uses the reduced inst instruction set computer options are mainframes option b supercomputers option c microcontrollers and last option personal computers the correct option for this question is microcontrollers next question is addressing modes in cpu are related to what option a data transfer option b memory management option c input output operations and last option arithmetic operations the correct option is memory management next question is what does dma stand for in the context of input output organization see guys it, the question is what does dma stand for the sorry what does dma stand for in the context of input output organization option a direct memory allocation option b data memory access option c direct memory access option d dynamic memory allocation See guys, this is not a DSA that is dynamic memory allocation. The question is in the context of input output organization. So the correct option is 
direct memory access next question is what is the role of peripheral devices in input output organization option a execute arithmetic operation option b communicate with the main memory third option interface with cpu and the option d is manage the cache memory the correct option is interface with the cpu next question is what is the purpose of direct memory access transfer in input output organization option a execute arithmetic operation option b accelerate data transfer between memory and input output devices option c manage the cache memory and option d is interface with the cpu so the correct option for this question is accelerate data transfer between memory and input output devices next question is what is the primary function of cache memory in the computer system option a long term data storage option b speed up data access option c virtual memory management and last option main memory organization the correct option is speed up data access moving to next question memory hierarchy is designed to what option a increase data storage capacity improve data access speed implement complex instruction sets or last option interface with peripheral devices the correct option is improve data access speed next question is which algorithm is commonly used for addition and subtraction in computer arithmetic options are binary search bubble sort third option divide and conquer and last option two's complement the correct option is two's complement next question is what is the primary characteristics of parallel processing in computer systems options are single processor execution option b sequential data transfer option c simultaneous data processing and last option reduced memory hierarchy so the correct option is simultaneous data processing next question is what is the key feature of next generation processor architecture option a reduced clock speed increased power consumption option c improved performance per watt or last option decreased transistor count the correct option is improved performance per watt next question is micro architecture primarily focus on option a external device communication option b internal design of the processor third option memory hierarchy management and the last option input output organization so the correct option for this is internal design of the processor the next question is which type of processor is commonly used in smartphone and tablets options are risk option b cisc option c mainframe or last option is supercomputer so the correct option is risk we use is risk processor in smartphone and tablets next question is what is the main function of a shift register option a data storage option b arithmetic operations option c logic operations and last option is memory access so the correct answer is arithmetic operations moving to next question in combinational circuits the output depends on what option a is current state only or next option previous state only or c both options which is current state and previous state and last option is none of the above so the correct option is c both current and previous states the next question is which oh sorry what is the primary purpose of a logic micro operation option r data transfer logical manipulation 
और द थर्ड ऑप्शन मेमोरी एक्सेस एंड लास्ट ऑप्शन अर्थमेटिक ऑपरेशन सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज लॉजिकल मैनिपुलेशन द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वॉट इज रजिस्टर्ड ट्रांसफर लैंग्वेज यूज फॉर ऑप्शन आर हाई लेवल प्रोग्रामिंग ऑप्शन बी असेंबली लैंग्वेज प्रोग्रामिंग ऑप्शन सी डिस्क्राइबिंग माइक्रो ऑपरेशन एंड लास्ट ऑप्शन मेमोरी मैनेजमेंट सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज डिस्क्राइबिंग माइक्रो ऑपरेशन मूविंग टू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द इंस्ट्रक्शन साइकिल इन कंप्यूटर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कंसिस्ट ऑफ सो वी हैव टू गिव द प्रोसेस सो ऑप्शन ए इज फेच एग्जीक्यूट स्टोर ऑप्शन बी फेच डिकोड एग्जीक्यूट ऑप्शन सी फेच डिकोड एंड स्टोर एंड लास्ट ऑप्शन इज एग्जीक्यूट स्टोर एंड फेच सो द करेक्ट आंसर इज फेच डिकोड एंड एग्जीक्यूट मूविंग टू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वट इज द करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ कंप्लेक्स इंस्ट्रक्शन सेट कंप्यूटर ऑप्शन ए लार्ज इंस्ट्रक्शन सेट ऑप्शन बी स्मॉल इंस्ट्रक्शन सेट ऑप्शन सी रिड्यूस्ड पावर कंजप्शन and last option is simplicity in programming so the correct answer is large instruction set next question what is the purpose of direct memory access in data transfer options are speeding up instruction execution option b reducing memory access time or option c facil facilitating Direct communication between peripherals and managing cache memory. So the correct option is facil facilitating direct memory communication between peripherals. Sorry, I'm still not sure about. So the next question is, what does the term interrupt refer to? In interrupt. आउटपुट ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑप्शन ए एन एरर इन द इंस्ट्रक्शन सेट ऑप्शन बी अ रिक्वेस्ट फॉर सीपीयू अटेंशन ऑप्शन सी अ टाइप ऑफ मेमोरी एक्सेस और ऑप्शन डी अ स्पेसिफिक टाइप ऑफ डेटा ट्रांसफर तो करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज अ रिक्वेस्ट ऑफ सीपीयू अटेंशन सो गाइस दिस इज द सेकंड लास्ट क्वेश्चन Oh, uh, if you guys enjoy this video, then do subscribe and share with your friends. Now moving to the next question: Which memory type is the fastest among the following? So we have to choose the fastest one memory. So option A is cache memory, option B virtual memory, option C main memory, or last option is auxiliary memory. so the correct answer is cache memory which is fastest and the last question is what is the purpose of memory management in a computer system the options are to allocate sorry to allocate cpu resources option b to organize and coordinate input output or operations of Op option c to manage data stored in registers and last option to optimize the uses of available memory and the correct option is to optimize the use of available memory that's it guys thank you guys and don't forget to subscribe the channel and don't forget that you are ingenious thanks and bye bye